providing this wonderful support network for families that have suffered, have a family member who suffered from mental illness, which is us. And so it's so great they're getting the word out there and beating down the stigma, and we think NAMI rocks. We're walking for our patients and for everyone that suffers from mental illness. It touches everyone's lives, and that's why we're here. Yeah, I think the illnesses that we deal with in psychiatry, psychology, uh, are definitely some of the most prevalent and most important. I mean, they not only affect the patients, but their entire families. And um, it's really important that we get uh, people to be more conscious about about uh, what's going out there and uh, how much uh, this type of events can support this individuals who have mental illness. According to the National Institute of Mental Health, in 2010, an estimated 45.9 million adults aged 18 or older in the United States had a mental illness in that past year. This represents 20% of all adults in this country. My name is Rita Hardy and I'm walking today in memory of Joshua Marks. Joshua Marks was my good friend's son. Uh, Joshua was about 27 years old and he committed suicide. He had uh, been on the show, Top Shelf Sub. Is it America or just Top Shelf? Top Shelf. <laughs> Master Chef, Top Chef, one of those shows, and he was, uh, he came in second place, and he got a little bit depressed about that, and a couple of other things went on in life, and he took his life last year, right around this time, coming up on the one year anniversary. And we walked to support Paulette, which is his mom, and to just honor Joshua, because he was a great kid, he went to college, he graduated cum laude. Uh, he was really into church, he was a Christian, and he became became a spokesperson for mental illness. I think it's called Make a Sound. He's on YouTube with a lot of different little recipes that he did and he was a phenomenal man and uh, we miss him, we love him and that's why we're out here today to support Paulette and to honor Joshua. I walk for people who suffer in silence, whose stories are untold, who suffer from depression, who have considered suicide, who struggle to this day just to survive each day, who have nobody to talk to, who are seriously in a lot of pain and anguish and struggle each day just to smile. So I'm here walking on behalf of those people and to let them know that this wonderful organization exists and that they can get help. There's people who care and there's lots of support for them. I walk for the memories of those who have fallen to their illnesses. I walk for solidarity. I walk for those who have been told their whole lives that they are less than. I walk because we deserve better. I walk to fight the stigma. Why I walk for NAMI? As a person who has worn the weathered armor required to fight the beast called depression, I deeply advocate for the equal rights of all, despite their differences, despite their uniqueness. Those with mental illnesses constantly face discrimination and unfair stigmas that often make it very difficult to seek help. The illusion that we all must achieve this badge of normality hurts both us and our communities. I support and walk for NAMI because I believe in equality. And so I say to you, my sporks, you are unique and you are beautiful. Good night, my lovelies.